New Hampshire voters are headed to the polls to decide their candidate in the nation's first GOP primary. I'm saying get out and vote. This is important. The first ballots cast overnight in Dixville Notch, a midnight tradition. All six voters picking Nikki Haley, who's locked into a tense showdown with former President Donald Trump for the Republican nomination. But I love this state. We've done well here before. In 2016, I came here. I sort of needed a victory. And I won by 21 points. And the stakes are clear to voters. They spoke with our Eva Pilgrim. Why do you think it's so important for people to vote in this primary? because the country's a mess. Donald Trump is looking to deliver a knockout victory over Nikki Haley. He scooped up support from former rivals who each ended their own campaigns before backing him. We need Donald Trump. America needs Donald Trump. If you want to make America great again, vote Trump. If you want four more years of Donald Trump, let me hear you scream. Trump with a machine of support, but Haley has put a lot of muscle into her own campaign, crisscrossing the state for over 41 days, with 81 events compared to Trump's 15 days on the trail and 17 rallies. And though Trump is leading by double digits, she's hoping to pull off a major upset, visiting polling locations today to pull in votes one handshake at a time. I fight the political class. Donald Trump has the political class surrounding him. That's not what Americans want. And meanwhile, President Biden, Vice President Harris, and their spouse are holding a rally in Virginia to discuss abortion access. Meanwhile, New Hampshire Secretary of State is predicting record turnout today. As for Nikki Haley, she's committed to staying in this race, win or lose. I'm Morgan Norwood, ABC News, Manchester, New Hampshire.